Now you probably haven't heard me talk about video games, and that's because I don't really care about them. I certainly don't advocate them, but I accept that they exist, okay? I'm not really so bothered about them. However, one thing that does pique my interest are games in the Teletype terminal, because how magnificent is that? Maybe you're a system administrator and you've got some time to burn, and maybe you just want to play say a game of solitaire while you're just having a 15 minute break. I think that's pretty cool, don't you? Probably through SSH, even cooler. So what I'm gonna to do today is look at a terminal based game that is of course a solitaire game, as I've just mentioned. And the great thing about this is you probably won't need the latest Nvidia or um, whatever graphics card to run it, it should just work basically on a potato and a 2000 year old ThinkPad. How great is that? So, let's have a look at this fantastic Solitaire game. And if you don't know what Solitaire is, don't worry, just hang around, I will show you. And if you're from Britain, of course, it's called Patience. So have some patience and you'll find out. Okay, so let's look at the package name for this TTY Solitaire, appropriately named. So again, this is going to work in the Linux terminal, the TTY. And um, it is just called TTY Solitaire. Still being maintained technically. It was only last year, as long ago as six months ago, the latest package build. And the dependencies are just Git and NCurses. How great. So. Uh, interestingly, NCurses, of course, is a kind of like a graphics toolkit for the TTY. I wouldn't necessarily say it's a graphics toolkit. We could look up what NCurses is. Maybe we'll do it another time. Um, whatever. Whatever. We'll look at it another time. So, that's all you need to know really about that. Let's install it. There are a few things you need to be aware of. So, I'm going to go into my um, virtual machine and I am in the TTY, I'll prove to you, I'm on my Linux terminal. So echo term, fantastic. Okay, so um, first thing to do is of course update your packages. This goes without saying. If you're on um, a different system, do your own package update. Now of course, uh, I don't tend to mention the other systems. I just take it for granted that people watching this channel are probably using Arch or understand Linux. But obviously, if you're running Debian or whatever, you you will know or you should know how to update your system. Okay. Now, again, the uh, actual command will be relative to your system, but we're on Arch, so it's sudo pacman s tty solitaire. And if I put my password. I should already have it installed if I put in my password correctly, of course. If I don't, try again. And yes, I'm not reinstalling it. It is, uh, I think, 30 KB. I don't know. Look how small that is. Anyway, fantastic. So, now there are a couple of things to consider. We will have a look at the, um, the GitHub page for TTY Solitaire. And it is as simple as this, TTY Solitaire in your shell. So TTY solitaire, enter. Now here's the first thing you need to consider. What is the terminal size? Now the easiest way really, you can you know do all this stuff, but I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna change the font because I can't be bothered to go into that. Um, as, as simple as that. So let's get this so let's change it. I've got it on here. If I go back, so I've just been using this font here and it looks nice as well. So uh, let's try again. So if you're, let's actually, first of all, if you've got a, if you do set font, this goes back to the original uh, or the standard Teletype terminal, the default uh, font. And if I put in TTY Solitaire, as you can see, it's pretty small. Okay, so I'm going to use a font like this that just sets the terminal width. I'll probably do a separate video on terminal width in the TTY, but yeah, I mean, it, we're really only doing it for this, okay? So I'm going to do it again, solitaire, TTY solitaire. And here we go, it gives you some instructions. I'm actually going to put on screen key and show you 
how to use it. Um, it's pretty simple, so it's basically Vim keys, even better. That's what we like to hear. Use the spacebar to select and place cards. After selecting a card, you can use M to select more, N to select less, press Shift N to select all, press spacebar to play or quit on this screen. So there we go. There it is, looking very nice on that green background. Um, so let's put on screen key and let's show you how this thing works. Okay, now you might not know how to play Solitaire. I will put a link in the description, a Wikipedia link you can learn how to play, but I'm just gonna show you how to play Solitaire or Patience as we call it. So if you remember, J and K are Vim keys. So that's up and down, uh, H and L moves uh, left and right. Okay, pretty simple. Now, um, so what do you do in Solitaire? Well, you're basically just um, making a uh, a pack of cards. Uh, sorry, you're, you're basically sorting the cards in numerical order and ace, king, jack order. I don't know if you played it for a long time, so why not? Let's, let's just show you how it goes. So, oh, and you have to have opposite colors. That's usually how it goes. So, for example, I've got a seven, and that can go on an eight, okay? If I hit space, that gives me a new card, a king. Uh, aces, I believe, can go into here. So that's starting off that. Um, and then I think you've got to put in the correct suit. So if it's whatever that is, a square, has to be a two square. Does that make sense? Let's see how far we get. I'm not gonna go too long into playing a game on stream, on stream, on video. Um, okay, I can't see anything matching there, so let's go into this deck here. Let's press space. We've got an eight. That's no good for us. We've got a two. Uh, that's, that can go on to here, I believe. No, that can't go on to there. Can't go on to there. I guess you've got to do like a, maybe this one. God, so long since I played it. No. Okay. Maybe you've got to do a king. Nope. Okay, I've got to remember how to play solitaire. Maybe you've got to get the full deck first and then you can start putting it on. God, I can't remember. How bad is that? Anyway, we're five. That's no good. An ace. I can go on here. I guess you can put aces on these as well, but it's no point. They can just go up there. I think that's right. Anyway, or well, maybe it's a king. Maybe it's a king. Can a king go up here? No. Okay. Okay, this is a very good demonstration of not playing solitaire very well. Okay. We've got a 10. A 10 can go on a jack, but not a red jack. We've got a jack, can't go on anything. A 10. That can go on nothing. A king. Go on nothing. A nine. Uh, got a ten. Nothing. Six can go on a seven, but we haven't got what we need. A ten can go on a jack. Okay. We're getting somewhere. We're getting somewhere. So I've got a nine. No. So six can go on a seven, but we haven't got seven. Eight can go on nine, but we haven't got nine. One successful hand. Come on. See how we far we get. Probably switching off. Uh, got Jack. Uh, can't go on there. An Ace. An ace. I just wanna. I just wanna show you a couple more of the combinations. So Jack can go on a Queen. We haven't got Queen. Ten can go on a Jack. We haven't got Jack. Queen. Okay. I can go on here. We've got a Jack. No. Ten. I got two. Can go on a. Three, three can go on a four. Four can go on a five. Got nothing there. Oh yeah, two can go on here. Eight can go on a nine. No, I think I'm doing this right. Two can go on a three. Oh. Okay, ten can go on. Nine can go on a ten. Okay. Eight can go on a nine, two. I thought this could go on here. Maybe not. Oh, I see I haven't got the correct suits. Oh, that's one thing to be aware. Make sure you're putting on the correct suits. It's not actually showing the suits as I said. Maybe that's a font issue. Okay. Troubleshooting. 
troubleshooting. Okay, how are we doing here? Nine. Okay, okay, we got an eight that can go on there, yep. Yeah. Eight can go on there. Okay, seven. Oh, no. Seven could go on an eight. Uh, queen can go on a king, but we've got eight. Four can go on a five. Oh, we've got a six, no. King, no. Ten can go on a jack, no. Jack can go on a queen, yeah. So we've got a ten, no. We've got ten there, we can go on here. And then a king, ten. We can go on a jack. <sighs> okay, it's probably going on far too long. What I wanted to show you was, so if you wanted to move, say, uh, all of these cards, a jack, onto uh, a queen. So, okay, here we go. So if I hit uh, shift, uh, control M, no, or is it shift M? No, um, oh, I can't remember the thing. Uh, anyway, you can, you can basically select all of the cards you can look at the documentation by using M because we want to move this whole grouping of cards over to here. See, that's what I wanted to show you. Okay, fantastic. And then we carry on. Now I'm not going to go on anymore. I've given you the hint of how to do this. So again, you, you want to build up all these all these um, rows here. So again, you could put the two up here, for example. See how it goes. And then uh, if that's the right, literally the right suit, it's not. Um, let's try that there you go that's how you, you want to keep uh, filling up that and then get all the cards and then fill it up now technically um, not all patience games can be completed all solitaire games so who knows you might have fun with that one thing I will do is I do like a a black background of course that green's just a bit too much for me I know it's appropriate and of course you can have different four color deck See, this is the thing you probably want, is a uh, four color deck. So what's that called? Four color deck. Ooh. So there you go. You want to, really, that's the, that's the option you want, a four color deck, and that's going to give you all the correct, um, so it's going to change the squares to the correct um, squares, so you're not going to put the wrong cards on. So that's a nice little thing, and I guess you can maybe combine it with um, no background, is it? Uh, no background color. Oh, Mwah. that's how it should be played. Use that. Make sure you get a nice width for the screen. Who knows, maybe you, you have a nice little break today and you just want to play TTY Solitaire while you wait for your system updates or something. I don't know, who knows. And uh, that's it, really. That's all there is to it. And again, if you're on a different system, these are all the different commands. I'll put this all to install it. I'll put this in the thing. Maybe we'll look at some more terminal games, as long as they're not too cringe. As long as they're not too cringe. But And I'll put the instructions on how to play Patience or Solitaire in the thing. Um, and this is, this is the Terminus font. So if you did want the font that I was using, you can do, again, sudo pacman-s terminus font and you can look at my whole video on fonts in a previous video that I've already done okay I think that's pretty much it if that wasn't too insufferable watching me play solitaire um, there we go so you know what to do with the uh, fake YouTube thing you can like you can comment and you can subscribe and uh, I'll see you in the next one